STEM education is a fresh educational approach that integrates knowledge from four fields: sciences, technology, engineering, and mathematics. This unified approach can lead to the development of new processes or products that are useful in everyday life and work. Why is STEM education a must? First, the number of students who are interested in sciences, mathematics, and technology has been declining. Second, competition is higher than ever for people with science and technology skills suitable for manufacturing and services. Third, the STEM field is short of people with the knowledge and skills appropriate for professions that will become. More important in the arts and economic community, integration is at the heart of STEM education. This helps students to connect the content of all four subjects in their daily lives and work. STEM classrooms features four levels of integration. First. Disciplinary students acquire knowledge and skills in each STEM subject separately. Second, multidisciplinary integration. Students acquire knowledge and skills in each subject based on a theme designated by teachers of joint disciplinary. The theme will connect contents of each subject. Third, interdisciplinary integration. Students acquire knowledge and skills in at least two subjects. Activities are then used to help demonstrate the way the different subjects are connected. Fourth, transdisciplinary integration. Aside from acquiring proficiency in all four subjects, students will have opportunities to apply their knowledge and skills to real-life problem-solving, as well as create their own learning experience. Let's look at a practical example of a STEM education approach in which students develop an electric toy car. The integrated approach provides knowledge in all four areas as follows: science, calculating the speed ratio of objects, buildings, and connecting an electrical circuit, building and connecting a power cell, mathematics. Calculating the cost of building the toy car by adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing, and percentages. Technology: using information technology to search for data, using hardware and software tools, and products derived from innovation. Engineering: designing a problem-solving plan or a work based on an engineering design process. Thailand is actively promoting this new way of learning through a STEM network consisting of a national and 13 regional STEM centers. There are three other elements support the work of these STEM centers and the school in their network. First. STEM ambassadors. These are experts from various professions that are based on practical application of STEM knowledge. They include medical doctors, pharmacists, engineers, architects, scientists, and archaeologists. This ambassador can help inspire students to take courses in sciences, mathematics, and technology. They can also advise teacher on how to connect knowledge and skills in analytical thinking in the field of sciences, technology, engineering, and mathematics. The goal is to create learning experiences for students and encourage more of them to enter into STEM professions. Second, the I STEM system. This is a digital center that is used as an online learning resource. It delivers information, textbook content, innovation, teaching, and learning media via the internet, so that students have convenient access to all the information they need. Third, STEM Hall of Fame. Set up to honor people with high STEM skills, is also a center where outstanding work can be displayed to interested students for their further learning as well as inspiration. 
In conclusion, STEM education is an educational management method. Its main purpose is to enable students to apply knowledge in sciences, technology, engineering, and mathematics from their classrooms to solve problems in their real lives. STEM education aims to build experiences, life skills, and creative thinking that can lead to innovations, turning young people into capable thinkers and workers. These young talents eventually will become a major force in the country's development.